Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Honorable judges and friends, how do you do? I'm Dafa from Shafiq Center High School. Do you favor with Salma? I think we know him well. Right now, I will tell you about Salma. Prophet Sulaiman Alaihissalam. Sulaiman, in Hebrew, in Prophet Hud and Dominion. This was not a matter in protest, as Prophet do not degrade the property. It is given away to the poor and other privileged, not to their religious. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, "The Prophet's property will not be inherited, and whatever we leave is to be used for charity." And indeed, we gave knowledge to them and Sulaiman, and they both said, "All the praise and thanks be to Allah." Who has prepared us about many of his living things? And Sulaiman, in her knowledge of them, he said, "O oh, mankind, we have been taught the language of her, and all us have been read all things. It's absolutely an every grace from Allah." And there were children for Sulaiman, his host of jinns and men and birds, and they were all set in battle. After his father died, Sulaiman became king. He waited to Allah for a kingdom, such as after him would have, and Allah granted his wish. Besides them, Allah had blessed Sulaiman with many abilities. He called them the winds and asked them how to talk to birds and animals. Allah directed him to teach bird men and jinns. To mine gear and extract its mineral to make tools and weapons. And also, he fabricated a mine which was a rare metal in those days. During his time, horses were the common mode of transportation. They were really essential for the face to carry soldiers and carry provision and weapons of war. The animal were well cared for and well trained. One day, Sulaiman was reviewing the plan of his temple. The fitness, beauty, and the posture of the horse kept feeding him so much that he kept on stroking and admiring them. The sun was never setting, and the time for the middle prayer was passing by. When he realized this, he exclaimed, I should love the variety of life. Then the service of man returned to him. Almighty Allah said, We fell and to thou we gave to Sulaiman. How excellent a slave! For me, he was ever returning in remorse to us. <coughs> when they were displayed before him in the afternoon, well trained the horse of the high speed for the high Allah's ghost and said, Alas, I did love this good horse. Instead, remembering my Lord in my astray, till the time was over and the sun had hidden in the veil of the night. Then he said, Bring them back to me. And then he passed his head over their legs and their legs. Till, till the end of this day. And indeed, we did try Sulaiman and we placed on his throne just then. But he, read, he did read it to Allah with obedience and every mass. He said, My Lord, forgive me and grant unto me a kingdom such as shall not belong to after me. Slowly, we were placed over. So, we subject to him the wind. It went gently to his other with his soul ever he was. And also, the devils from the jeans, including every kind of poodle and devil, and also other born infants. One day, Sulaiman delivered his army, which had different battalions of men, and jeans, and bird, and animal. He mercied them to the country of Ascalon. While 
they were passing the water. An ant saw the approaching army and cried out to the war. The other ant said, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.